Hello friends, I am Shushant Raghavan. Welcome to Technical and Quality Session. For understanding the technical requirements and quality standards in clothing industry, making a sustainable garment, I have good practical experience in the apparel manufacturing sector. My skills are CAD pattern making, sample development, technical requirements, and measuring quality performance. Today's session is about fabric bowing and screwing in clothing industry. For more sessions like this, do like and subscribe to my channel. Now let's begin the presentation. Fabric bowing and screwing. Bowing and screwing are defects which are created when there is a distortion in weft laid across the whole width of the fabric. Both needs to be taken care and handled properly during weaving and finishing to avoid wastage at garment production stage. Bowing. Bowing is a common fabric defect in woven fabrication where weft or filling yarns are displaced from a line which needs to be perpendicular to the selvage and lie in a wave or arc across the width of the fabric. Bowing can be called as a defect but in case of some woven patterns, 2 by 2 twills, bowing is being introduced during fabric processing in fabric to avoid residual bowing in the final finished fabric. Picks are inserted at an angle of 90 degree during beating action so warp and weft should be at a perpendicular angle always but it never happens post beating fell of cloth fabric goes through a lot of processes and formation of bowing happens bowing formation at the weaving stage nowadays fabric are being produced on high speed shuttle looms where fabric selvage at both ends is being held by temples having sharp pins impregnated in the fabric which in turn avoid fabric to roll back post beating action due to let of motion force. During take up action when the fabric is being pulled then application of force is more at the center of the fabric and less at selvage due to temple hold and bowing of 1 inch to 1.5 inch is being generated in the fabric at both selvages ends this is called as residual bowing at grey fabric. Lighter the fabric in weight GSM more chances of bowing and heavier the fabric in weight GSM fewer chances of bowing will be there. Finer the yarn count in direct system, more chances of bowing and closer the yarn count then fewer chances of bowing will be there. Above mentioned bowing can be corrected during fabric processing and doesn't impact fabric geometry and its dimensional stability. Bowing formation at the processing stage. Fabric in processing mill go through a lot of processes like singing, desizing, bleaching, moisturizing, dyeing sanferizing and stentering. There can be other processes like peaching etc. During all these processes fabric has to pass through set of rollers many times and every time when fabric passes through them a nip of rollers there is a chance of bowing formation if there is any speed variation in between two sets of rollers. Another important reason for bowing generation is machine operator neglects during fabric stitching for lot preparation. Proper care and attention is being given by operator then bowing can be minimized. At any given point of time if a roll of grey fabric is being stitched with another grey roll at an angle then it's a start of bowing and this will increase in further processing. Stentor machine is key machine in fabric processing and acts an important role in fabric bowing. If the fabric is not being fed properly in stentor machine then chances of fabric bowing generation will be there. If machine is equipped with automatic weft straightening device, it monitors the bowing direction automatically and adjusts the feeding tension at center and selvage according to the situation. Measurement of bowing. Measurement of bowing. As per picture given below, you can see distortion at the center of fabric marked as B and total fabric width is being as D. Bowing can be calculated as below. Percentage equal to B divided by D into 100. Screwing. Screwing is a common fabric defect in woven fabrication where weft or filling yarn are distorted means pattern on one side of the fabric is ahead or behind the pattern on the opposite side. This is usually caused in fabric weaving or processing when both fabric edge will be pushed by roller with different force. So due to the difference in force at each edge cause the movement of weft pattern. Lighter the fabric in weight GSM, more chances of screwing and heavier the fabric in weight GSM, fewer chances of screwing will be there. 
finer the yarn count direct system more chances of skewing and closer the yarn count then the fewer chances of skewing will be there measurement of skewing measurement of skewing as per picture given below you can see distortion at selvage of fabric marked as b and total fabric width is being as d skewing can be calculated as below percentage equal to b divided by d into 100 Thank you for watching. For more sessions like this, do like and subscribe to my channel. Please comment your valuable thoughts and don't forget to press the bell icon to get notified when I post a new presentation. Bye, have a good day.